Hello, hello, and welcome back to some more 1.0.6a beta Wild Frost. Um, let's get right into it. I was just Shademancers, just had a banger game with Mimic, um, and Snoof, and supporting cast, of course. Um, so let's move on to Junk. Marturf, Nibak, and Ronish. Hmm, Marturf seems the best here. This one's pretty cool. 6 HP scares me, though, for sure. This is makes me feel much more secure. So let's do it. Okay, and as is tradition, I'll be rolling a die to determine which companion I'll be picking. And we rolled a 1 again, so we're running Snoop again. Let's get it. Ah, if it isn't the Naked Gnome. We'll see if we can keep the no Naked Gnome alive. I won't try that hard, I'll be honest. This thing is going to need to get uh, either inked or snowed, though. Maybe I ink it. I know it's two damage, but... Um, let's see, because I would... Uh, yeah, if I had two gear hammers, I'd just double gear hammer it, to be honest. I'm going to snow it. Then Snoof will hit it. And then I'll hit it. Uh, I guess I need to get these guys out if I'm going to not kill this thing. Uh, what now? I guess I'll do this. I don't know how I'm not gonna kill this snake and gnome. The more I think about it, I think I just will kill it. We'll see, we'll see. I think I'm just gonna keep hitting this thing. Oh, maybe there's a way. I'm starting to see the way. Well, A, we just end the fight like this, yeah? Yeah. So we'll just have no money. And, ooh, nice. This is actually adds a good amount. Five gold amount. This is fine with me. And the naked gnome survives. Did you look at that? 72 gold's okay. It could have. Yeah, that's not that bad, actually. Come join me, Naked Gnome. Get out of here! No, no, no. We'll let him in. Um. Now, where do we want to go? Let's go up. That seems obvious. Okay, if I get a Sun Charm, I will play around Naked Gnome. That's not a sun charm. There's still hope, though. We'll see what happens. Krego, Skaven, or Bonnie. <sighs> These are all units. Is it a Skangle or a Krangle? Or a Bangle? I'm thinking it's a Skangle or a Krangle, personally. I'm a little indifferent. I think Skaven's a lot better now. A lot, lot better now. I'm gonna take Skaven. Very solid hero. One thing I could do is immediately slap this on him as well. Or I could slap this on my hero too. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't hold on to this pinch charm like I feel like I usually do. And then I only put it on someone when it's like, when I've discovered that I'm not going to get any better charms for them. This is good. I think I'm just going to do this. This is a scary earth berry. Scare berry. I don't think I'm going to bother with any uh, combos here. I'm just going to, oh, 
I said that and then I accidentally didn't hit this thing, and I meant to. That was a bit of a silly goof. Uh, what am I doing here though? I can do this, I guess, take two. I don't really want more junk in my uh, deck right now, but I will drop this thing before I go. I might snow cake whatever comes out here if something's scary. Uh, I might snow cake this earth berry. I'm gonna do it. Maybe I should have gone down, and I, I definitely should have gone down. Here's what I can do, though, is I can look for, uh... Oh, I forgot I had Naked Melon doing this. I can do this, and then we'll get a two combo here, and it'll kill the Earthberry before he goes, importantly. There is a Snow Burp attacking. I'd prefer it not to do that. We could just do this, though. Or we could ink it. Both are fine approaches. What are we doing about this goblin that wants to run away? Do we want to do anything about it? I do. I'd like to farm that gold. I think I'll be safe. Oh, I didn't get the snow. <laughs> okay. Well. Sometimes you don't get it, and sometimes you get it. I'm just gonna do this. I got four gold before he runs away. I've, I've been made a fool. Okay, here's what I'd like to do. I'd like to do a little bit of this. And then uh, a little bit of this, I guess. Should I do that? I could let Naked Gnome tank the Globbery. Globbery. That seems pretty mean to the newcomer, though. I'm just gonna start sniping this girl. Take a two combo. And how are we doing this? What are we doing? Who am I? Uh, duh, I can just ink the globbery. Globbery. It doesn't even matter. Ah, I wish I could kill this thing. I guess I can do this and then go look. The other issue with that, of course, is that I don't necessarily draw. Um ink again. Yeah, I'm not going to do that then. I'm just going to take the two damage here. I think it's fine. And we'll just do this. And just because I'm afraid, and I know it works, I'm going to do this. Although, I actually fr I did freeze this thing here. These guys are all aligned, so... I'm just going to get the naked gnome out. He's not aligned, though. But he'll be fine. Okay, everything dies. Good job, Naked Gnome. You did great. Okay. Let us move on from this. 148 is not the most amount of gold after two combats, but it should be sufficient. Rono has arrived, Bink has arrived. I think it's another Chrono angle. It's really hard to say no to Chrono. Bink is great too, for the record. Bombarder is good when it's good. And I do like Frostbelt as a card, honestly. But I don't think it's uh It would be like a, a case where there aren't multiple good cards really good cards. Hmm, Greed Charm. Ooh, Greed Charm, Naked Gnome. 
Okay, Blunder Tank, Magma Booster, Blaze Bomb, or Ice Dice. So my brain automatically filters out Ice Dice, because I'll never take them. I've taken them once. And my assessment, my hypothesis that they are bad, felt like it was true. Uh, Magma Booster is very solid. I'm getting a call again. Be right back. Uh, I forgot to stop the video. I apologize for that. So there might be just like a minute of uh, of dead time. But I hope you enjoyed the silence. Welcome back. I think I'm going to do Magma Booster. And maybe we can do something really cool with, uh, with Naked Gnome and Greed Charm here. I think I'm going to go for it. We don't have to commit to anything quite yet. But, uh, that's where the winds are leading us. Should we just do it now so I can't go back on it? Yeah, it'd be really hard to go back on it if I just did this, yeah? I'm gonna show him the good life. Look at the greed he has now. Let's do this. Um, actually, is Snoof better with Crown than Skaven right now? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, Naked Gnome, get out there, buddy. Oh, all right, I'm hitting, hitting what I needed to hit here, too. Do some of this, some of this. I could go snipe that thing too. I don't know. Let's do this. Actually, the thing is though, I'll have more damage once I uh, kill one of these guys. Oh, but I didn't. That's okay though. Oh, Chrono I think is better with Skaven. Although I'm going to have a lot of trash in my deck. Something to just keep in mind. I'm gonna do this so I can get my Snowzooka critical. I'm probably gonna snowcake the Bam, or sorry, the Boozle. Yeah, I could snowcake this and then uh, maybe Snowzooka Winter Worm. Oof. I'd really actually like to go hit this thing for two. So I can get a 3 combo here. But then I... Don't have anything to block this Winter Room. Like, I either need to play Junkhead or Snozuka. The other alternative is, of course, to go down. And then bring out whatever I'm bringing out. And then lots of things die next turn. Hmm. Thinking and thoughts. Thoughts and thinking. I done messed up, didn't I? I didn't bring the chrono down to. That was a goof and a half. That was a major goof alert. Yeah, I screwed up. It's okay, we'll move on. Oof. 
this unsung box. I don't, even, I don't even have my snoof out, do I? This thing's also happening soon, by the way. And it's kind of awkward because I can't really... I could make this guy not aimless, I suppose. Sometimes you goof, you know? Sometimes you goof. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna move on. I guess. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna do this and align these two then. The only issue with this, with this is that Bam Bam's going next. Wow, I really goofed. What am I doing then? Do I need to go look for Junkhead, I guess? Ah, oh, jeez, oh my, you know what I'm saying? Whatever, I'm gonna go look for Junkhead. I didn't find him, though. So what am I gonna do? Am I just gonna end the fight right now? Is that what Destiny leaves for me? Fine. Yeah, what a mistake. I could have had, like, <laughs> I had so much gold in my eyes, and I just, I dropped the bag. However. Oh, 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 oh. Is this the Chuckle Charm of Destiny that I've been hearing about? Let's do it. No further, no, no questions need to be asked here. We simply take the Chuckle Charm, and we go to every charm we can possibly go to. Fortunately, we can't go to this charm. But I can go grab... A, uh, another snow cake. Seems like the best of these. Gotcha, Pomper. Gotcha, Pomper. So, yeah. I think um, I think there's a chance I lose here, but if I don't lose here, oh man, am I going to be powerful? I guess I'll wait on this just in case. Yeah, let's let's hopefully not lose. I have two snow snow kicks. That should be that is a lot. I think we'll be okay. Do this. I think I'm gonna do this as well. Oh, right, I don't have my chrono yet. Five, eight. I'm just gonna kill this thing now. My thought is currently that we're just going to have um, Gawk hit into Junkhead. Let's see, three. Do some oh, we should move on here. Yeah, this is good. Uh, I think I'd rather do this, actually. Not give my hero a bunch of demon eyes. And, oh, wrong, 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 wrong. This one. We'll get a two combo still. This thing has a sun charm, by the way. Fun fact. Um, couple thoughts here. One, this is going off. That was the first thought. Second thought. Wow, lots, lots of options here. The one I'm most tempted by right now is to Sun Song Box Naked Gnome. This way it would go before the Jab Jotes, and then it'd be the one time, turn time we're going to the next turn. The other option is with this. I think I do want Snoof though. 
attacking into Gawk. Do I though? Because the Gawk will just be dead. This just puts a lot of uh, junk in my hand. Another option is I don't do any of that and I gotcha pumper next turn. And then everything's hitting barrage. Or sorry, that I gotcha pumper this turn. I'm just gonna go with what my first thought was. I think any of them work. Well, I don't. Let's bring out these guys and we're gonna gotcha pump now. I'm gonna drop this junk kit out. So what am I hitting? Eight? Oh, it doesn't quite kill, does it? Um, snow cake and snow cake down. So this barrage is useless down here, yeah. This is probably not the right alignment. This is not the right alignment either. How do I want to do this? How about this? Wait, does this make any sense? No. Nor does this. Oof. Yeah, the only issue I have is I really want to barrage this porcupine. Whatever, I'm just going to do this. I know this is wrong. Maybe I wouldn't have killed regardless of what I did there. So maybe that was fine. Okay. Let's go, we could get another companion for sure. Let's go down. And we get a charm machine. Bomb barrel, slap crackers. Probably bomb barrel. Maybe I'll find a sun charm or a sun cream and I'll be pretty much set. Fulby, Snobble. Snobble's an option here. I have gotcha pumper. I lack a little bit of health, but this just like hard replaces Snoof, and yeah, this is just sort of, sort of like a better Snoof in this setup. So I, I sort of like this. Okay, let's see what's in the crate. Newman Charm. That's a good hit. I don't know what I'm doing with it yet, though. Okay, Wooly Direct Time. Should I Noomlin something now? Maybe I should just Noomlin a Snowzuka or a Flask of Ink. I do want to crown this thing. Hmm. I'm just wondering if I can afford to wait. I really don't have that much health on my units in total. Fulby might have been better, but I honestly have a lot of trash generation already and no recycling. Even more now. I think I'm going to do this out of safety. Yeah, I'm just not sure um, if I have like Exodia yet. I don't think that I do, but I'm close. I think I'm really close to having a winning combo. This is scary. This is a bad hit for me. This is good though. Um, I need a bomb barrel, I think. And just snipe this thing down slowly. And by slowly, I mean I just need two gear hammers on it. Or I could double. 
um, gear hammer double junk. I guess I got triple junk in that case too. I'll start with this. We could also let um, Skaven take three damage and go through here. I don't mind this. Or, or I could do... Nah, this doesn't quite work. I guess I'm probably snow caking that Bigfoot next turn then. Let's just do this. And what this allows me to do is... I guess this. Let's just do this. Ah, smackback. How rude. Do we want to ink then now? We could. We could also wait till Snobble goes. No, not really. Ah, because I kind of need to kill this thing now. Fine, I'll ink it. Kind of annoying. So I want to move on. Ah, this is annoying. If I Magma Booster now, it's going to have Aimless, but if I move it up next turn, it'll not have Aimless. I'll have Barrage still. So the question is, are we okay with taking two here? I have, an, I have another idea. I'm going to Magma Booster this now. Do five. I could just double gear hammer this thing. The only problem is this thing's going off. Yeah, I don't want that to go off. I don't have much sustain, do I? I might need to bring out Skaven here. I can do something like this right now. Maybe I'll just double gear hammer this thing too. I think I'm fine with that. Yeah, and I think everything upstairs is dead, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, no, it's not. I was mistaken. Okay, so I don't want my guy to die. Don't want my guy to die. I have some issues. Uh, one thing we can do is ah. Yeah, I don't want my I don't want my naked gnome to die here at all. So he's doing five still, is that right? Four extra damage. It's just not that much. This Papa is gonna take some additional work. I'll do this for now, I guess. So this thing will be at five, but with teeth. I can drop Skaven. Oh, we have a problem next turn, don't we? I think we'll be okay. We let a um, Gotcha Pumper die next turn, I think. Does that mean we don't play Skaven until after next turn? Right now my Naked Gnome dies to this Pawpaw next turn. Maybe we take out a uh, Naked Gnome then. Oh, uh, okay. I don't want to lose. I would prefer not to lose. I was afraid of this this combat. It's for a reason. Here's what we can do. We're gonna take Naked Gnome out. We're gonna take one here. Next turn we're sacrificing Gotcha Pomper 
to the Big Lou and Bigfoot. Oh, I see a problem. Oh, I see a big problem. Obviously, this will die immediately, and then five will go up and I will lose. Meaning we need to also lose Skaven or go search for something that prevents this. Junkhead prevents this. Snowzooka prevents this. Flask of Ink prevents... Does it? Flask of Ink doesn't prevent this. It could prevent... It could make... Uh, Flask of Ink would allow me to do something like this and not lose as well. Let's go move on then. Oh man, I got really nervous. That was the first four draws were... Uh, what do you say? Not good? Yeah, really bad even. I guess we'll just do this. We can take Gotcha Pumper out if we want. Do this. What comes out? Another Pawpaw? I would hate that. I think it is another Pawpaw. Maybe it's... Maybe it depends. Okay, it's a Grumble here. Do this and move on. Could also double snipe this thing. I kind of misclicked there, but it's fine. Oh, I don't know why I hit that thing. Well, it was a misclick. Um, but it also was my intention for a moment. Okay, let's just get out and get the heck out of here. Whew! I'm getting a little nervous about this run. Should I have a muncher? Maybe I should hit this muncher. Let's get rid of this junk. I have way too much junk right now. Lumen Lantern. Frenzy Wrench. Oh man, there's lots of options here. Frenzy Wrench, what is Frenzy Wrench good for here though? Snowzooka. Uh, that's not that great there. Would be nice to have some way to get rid of some of this junk though. Could even just go on like a gear hammer and it could get pretty juiced. help me wow what about this recycle eight no I can't do that nine attack and then goes away that is quite enticing that's so enticing Do I want to crown Chrono or Gotcha Pumper here? I probably should. Uh, I think let's go with Chrono. I guess I'll go with Chrono. Man, I wonder if this should go in Magma Booster. I feel like it should. Then would I crown this? I would probably crown Magma Booster here. Let's do it. Oh, it's 8 attack. For some reason I thought it was uh, 6, but no, that makes sense. I'm just thinking of Barry Bell being at 6 attack, or 6 health, and Flame Water being at 6 attack, but that's because they already have 1. Let's do this. Let us boost my Naked Gnome. Okay. Will we be okay? I think we'll be okay. We have um, we have two snow cakes on this fight. Honestly, that makes all the difference.
And then we definitely want uh, these three to be getting the dips. Oh, we could uh, frenzy wrench a dip here too, if we want. Yeah, we could do that. Is this too slow though? Oh, we could do this first. No, we're, we'll be okay. These guys go before. It's a little slow. I could do it this way then, just in case. I need to gear hammer that thing. Yeah, I'll probably end up doing that then. Um, let's do this, and then I'm just gonna gear hammer um, the pop shroom next turn. Oh, I, I see a slight problem. Problem is that I'm taking four damage on two units. Uh, what I could also do is just tank this and then drop Skaven out. I think I'll do that. Yeah, let's just do that. Because we want to go find Chrono or Gacha Pumper right now. Preferably Chrono, actually, because Martuf Marturf already has Barrage. Should I go down or up? Let's go down, actually. Because then we can snipe out the healthier members here. And this guy has a Lumen Ring, which is, of course, scary. And nothing else attacks for a while. Um, so we're not concerned about the Puff Balls as long as these two die. Now we send in. Now we send in the Gotcha Pomper for the Naked Gnome, and then next turn we're gonna Lumen Vase. We are going to Lumen Vase the Chrono for this Naked Gnome's next attack, and everything should die. We should bring these guys in. Hopefully, there's no Teeth Charms. There's not. Um. Yeah, everything's dead. Got some good money there too. Oh, wow! Squid charm, ink charm, or battle charm? N maybe we should gear up this leader health. It might be a little scary if I don't. But think about the power. I should definitely do the squid charm, and then I should debate between these. Ah, but the power. No, it's so greedy. I think I want the health. My health is low, but this... Oh, man, the squid charm is incredible. Honestly, my chances are looking much, much nicer now with that. Let's just do this now. We're all in now on the naked gnome. Charm merchant. Dang, imagine if I saw this Durian Charm first. I could Durian Charm Skaven. Moko Charm. Hmm. Well, Moko Charm could have been really cool with Snobble. I definitely could have waited until I saw this shot before I put this on Naked Gnome. This thing's got a Frost Charm on it. Wow. Anything I could do with any of these things? No. Yeah, the pomegranate charm doesn't interest me because all my things have barrage already. The moko charm doesn't interest me because I can't put it on naked gnome. I should have grabbed the battle charm. If I put, if I grab the battle charm, then I could put the moko charm on naked gnome. Dang.
That's a shame. That is a gosh darn shame, isn't it? Anything else that I would use these Moko charm for? I don't think so. One thought is Snobble. Because I'm empowering Snobble in theory, but I don't think it's worth it. It could just be a skip angle and use my five extra damage. The other option is Durian Charm on this, just so I get less trash and do more damage with him. 893 is a pretty good score line. He's just not really part of my damage rotation, though. At this point, Naked Gnome is doing the heavy lifting here. Uh, it's a little tough. Battle Charm would have made me really happy now. I could have thought about that for sure, but I didn't. Oof. Anything I'd want to change. Honestly, maybe I should not have this crowned. Maybe it's more important for this to be Gotcha Pumper Chrono. Because I'm already doing uh, 6 damage um, per hit with this guy. It might be more important to for him to have Barrage actually now because he has the Ink Charm too. Especially on the Bursters. Yeah, let's do it. Oh my god, my I'm having like a stroke. Okay, very nice to see this guy 15 HP too. Okay, Frenzy Charm is not usable yet here. We can do this and I'm probably just gonna, uh oh, I have a problem. So I'd really like the Molten Dip right now. I mean, I could Molten Dip without Naked Gnome. It's actually not important on this fight. Not that important. And I'll be giving him, uh, you know, 8 attack later, so... Um, let's do this. I'm gonna ink this Burster next. kind of like to go down with the snake gnome, but it'll be okay. Let's move on. I could have a sunsung box there too. Let's do this. brought them out again. But honestly he's on a two turn timer so it's it's fine. I hear ya. I might use this turn to Noomlin. I don't know. I'll just Noomlin a snow cake I guess. None of it really matters. I'm just gonna be a long drawn out sequence here. I'm just gonna I guess I'll just do this. Oh, duh. It is weird that it works like this, but I also get it.
launcher. Yeah, I can munch more. Oh, what I shade sculpt? I would shade sculpt. Another magma booster, maybe? Nah, because it doesn't really. I mean, I could put it on like Snobble, but I don't think it's necessary. I'd rather just go get three charms, maybe? Or maybe just two. Found the sun cream. Bomb charm. Do one more. I'm not sure if this is right, by the way, to be spending money. Wow, smack bag. Okay, now I have to do something to get sun cream out right away. Probably just includes this. I'm just gonna do this. Mm, and then I think I don't wanna lose my two gold or two damage for this. Let's go to the eye of the storm. Okay, we found the sun cream in the final moment. We prefer Gotcha Pumper here. Do we? The only problem with Gotcha Pumper is Grink doesn't die yet. Now nah, let's Chrono first. This makes way more sense first. Baby, I'm gonna do this even though I know it's not gonna do anything. And I'm not gonna bring these guys out. I always regret it. Every single time I regret it. Okay, cool. Now let's go look for Magma Booster. Hello, Magma Booster. The only issue with Magma Booster right now is that it, uh... Oh. This is annoying. This is rare, so annoying. So this will be aimless. And not barraged right now. Oh, it inks it. Duh. That's nice. Ah, uh, the issue with that is it'll die. So I guess I can do this. This is attacking, this is attacking. This will get smacked back, but I'll only smack back for two. This will live with one HP. Guess I'll just do this. Alright. 
Alright, take me home. Country road. I'm not a, I'm not hundred percent certain I'm fine on this last fight. I don't think I'm changing anything though. Ah, uh, so I need to snow kick Junker and I need this this um, bottom side to die first. So I have an issue. Maybe I don't send Maybe I can't send Gacha Popper with Naked Gnome. My issue is that Magma Booster. Oh, I needed to change my crowns. I needed Gacha Popper, or I needed Magma Booster in my opening hand. If I were gonna, if I was to do that, because the key is that you Magma Booster before the Gacha Poppers, before you place the Naked Gnome, and then you place it into the Gacha Popper, and then you have the Barrage. So what I may end up doing now is sending Chrono down, but I might send a buddy with Naked Gnome. Is this the way? I could send Marcher. I could send these guys up here to mess around. Yeah, I think that's the way. We are going to send Marcher here. Something like this. And I think I sh still should be able to join the rest of my crew pretty quickly. Gotcha, Pumper was not the draw here. What if we, uh. I guess we could Gotcha, Pumper for now. We could gotcha pumper for now and then move. Move on. This might be good actually. We should move on though to get a snow cake as soon as possible. Okay, well this thing's dead. This is actually good. This thing's dead and we can go ahead and snow cake this thing. I could Noomlin this. Noomlin Snowzooka this. Because, yeah, my guy will be fine here. I would like to delay this. If possible. Now we'll snow kick this and then we can move. Uh, here's what we can do we can slide Gotcha Pumper up right when Snobble attacks. The only issue is obviously we're losing the barrage on Naked Gnome. Which at this rate we are killing this thing before it attacks, yeah. But then this is going off next turn. Something tells me this is right. I'm not sure if it is though. Oh I'm I can move all my units, by the way. <laughs> this thing's inked. I am a fool. I am a fool. Well, regardless, I think I'm doing this right now. Okay, so there's a five barrage coming. This is fine. This is not fine. We'll let Skaven, we could let Mark Turf tank. Huh. I might do this actually. I'm gonna do this. Mark Turf's gonna be fine. And I guess I'll just redraw. Don't really wanna play this junk kid. I could, but. So, this is good, and then I'm gonna snow cake back rank. Oh no, he's gonna die. I don't need to snow cake it.
All right. Naked gnome carry. Yes. Oh. This is my first. I feel like true naked gnome carry. I love to see it. I'm really glad I committed to it early so that I wouldn't back out of it. Thanks so much for watching, as always. I really appreciate it and hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Until next time.